When we think about facials, we think about being pampered. But today I'm at Lena Rose Beauty to actually find out why they're a great way to maintain the health of your skin. Hey, Hi, Jenny. Jenny. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Come on in. Great. So Jenny, when we think about facials, a lot of us know what they are, but we don't know how they work. So give us the foundation of what a facial is. It's really a resurfacing for our skin, our largest organ in our body. So let's talk about the health benefits of facials because I know there are so many. It's getting rid of product buildup, any type of maybe overproduction of sebum and oils, SPF buildup, it just cleans the dirty windshield, reveals brighter, more even skin tone. Really, facials are good for anybody. Anyone, 18 or up, we're all really stressed out. We hold a lot of tension in our face, even when we don't realize it. A lot is coming at us in this modern world. Adulting is hard, so anytime you can take an hour for yourself is going to be beneficial to your mental health. We're coming in for our facial. We need to prep, just like we would going to any healthcare appointment. Be comfortable, wear loose fitting clothing. You don't have to remove your makeup, but if you would like to come clean face, that's great. Just come ready to relax. Okay, so I'm certain that there are steps to the facial. Can you show me how it works? Yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Okay, Jenny, we're in a treatment room and we've got the lovely Lily right here as our client ready for her facial. Talk me through the steps of how a facial works. We first begin with a consultation uh, to get to know like what their skin goals are, maybe any allergies. The next step is to cleanse and we do a double cleanse, uh, first with a water-based cleanser to remove pollution, product buildup, and then we use an oil-based cleanser to break down any makeup that might still be on, um, any balms that might be on the skin or lotion. After that comes toning. It's one of the most important products in a skincare routine because it pH balances the skin. Our skin needs to actually be slightly acidic to be at its healthiest. The toner will pH balance so the products you use afterwards will work a lot better. And then what comes after toning? Um, we do the exfoliation. It's a resurfacing for the skin. We have dead skin cell buildup. We want to remove all of that to clean the dirty wind shield, as I like to say. And that's followed by a mask. Our holistic estheticians will handcraft your the treatment mask, which really is the star of the show in a facial. It has the most nutrients in it, and you uh, will sit in the mask for about 10 to 15 minutes. The facial wraps up with extractions if requested, and then serum, moisturizer, and a facial massage. So let's just recap what we learned today, and that is that facials are a really great way to maintain the health of your body. Yes, of course. Facials are just really great for revealing brighter, rejuvenated skin. And seasonally, we really want to be resurfacing our skin, wiping that slate clean, starting off with a fresh face, and stimulating collagen production. It's a great treatment for restoring, repairing, rejuvenating dry, lackluster skin. Jenny, thank you so much. Thanks, Lily. To find out how other things work in the world of health, just head to our website, livinghealthytv.com. You want more content about living healthy? Well, it's easy. Check out these videos right here and subscribe right here for more.